Alright, settle in, my friends, because I have a very interesting story to tell you. Oh, really? What's it about, Majax? Oh, I'm glad you asked, Baby Lamb. You see, it's a story of the time I pulled off the biggest stunt in school history. No way. Oh, yeah. So, uh, what exactly did you do? Oh, well, see, basically, I was super bored because my teacher was being a, a, a butt face. So, I decided to change the sign and I summoned a bunch of cartoon characters. They thought that the school was their studio. <laughs> I don't think that's really happened. I think you're just making it up. Yeah, I think that story is a load of bull. <laughs> I swear, this is all true. Well, all right then, then just tell us. All right, so it was a long time ago in a school far, far away. Well, actually not really that far, far away since it was literally right here in Capital City, but it was a long time ago on one boring school day. Okay, class, today we're going to say a, a really easy math problem. Yay! Then I turned into a really, very, 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 the square root of 365 times 4,568 plus 4, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, divided by 3,681 times 46 times 46 times 46 plus 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, times 65 times you suck plus 1 million plus Three billion six hundred and thirty million two hundred seventy nine thousand one hundred forty eight divided by seven thousand six hundred eighty one plus five hundred cubed and stop playing that music. Well, I wanted to have some dramatic intention. Heh, <laughs> the nerve of some people. And to make it even more hard, you have under a minute to finish that. Begin and now. Oh man, this is really worth it. I mean, come on, this is impossible. I gotta find a good excuse to get out of this. This is really supposed to be an awesome school. What was I thinking? Wait a second. It can't be the classic excuses. No, 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 not the dog ate my homework kind. It's not even noon yet. No, no. Let's try the classics. Mr. Bowers, Mr. Bowers! What is it? Do you have some kind of excuse for today? What? What? <laughs> Excuse? No, 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 no. I'm just saying, I really need to go to the bathroom. And it's not even recess. Why should I care? I don't even have a watch. All right, but well, hurry back. Soon later, we're going to recite the times one million table. Thanks, bye. Well, that's a pretty smart move I pulled back there. It was awesome. That teacher was too dumb to notice. Well, I can't believe I just said that. Anyway, wait a second. What am I going to do with all the time I have going to the bathroom? Hmm. That's it! I need to f I need to come up with something cool. I, I could turn the school into something cool. Something that's not school. The problem is, what? Well, Nick Jr., Burger King, and Chuck E. Cheese's. We're already taken. And don't even get me started on Barney. There it is over there. Well, the simple thing I could do is maybe turn this place to Cartoon Network. Yeah, I'll turn it to Cartoon Network. I better get to work. 
uh, it turned to 15 uh, minutes uh, later. Anyway, the piece to our distance, the logo. I better put it on. Stop! Oh, man. It's tough being a principal. Why didn't I become a, sa a sausage doctor like my own mother wanted? Okay, class, today we're going to learn about the stratosphere. A total 16 hour movie showing you what there is to know about the universe and the stratosphere as we know it. What the? Who put this here? <laughs> I mean, come on, it's only like been, it's only been like 10 seconds, I, it's already fun. No, 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 it's this one. What the? I'm telling you, Warren's been taping silly kid shows over my documentary tape on the stratosphere. They're gonna be suspended! What's that noise? Kids, while I'm gone, don't do any funny business, alright? Hey, while he's gone, you wanna put cherry bombs on the toilet and then blow them up? Heck yeah. What the? What are you supposed to be doing here? You tourist? You new? You got lost? You're kidding me, right? Is this guy kidding us? Yeah, I think he is. Dude, this is Cartoon Network Studios. We're supposed to be here for our shows. Okay, I understand that from the looks of you uh, people, you're new here. So let me start you off pretty easy. This is school. School. This is a place for learning. Not stupid kid shows. Yeah, we know what school is. We all been to one. Well, everyone except for Finn. How'd you know this is Cartoon Network Studios? Because the sign over there says Cartoon Network. What? This is, it's not supposed to say it like that. Who was responsible for this? Of course, Majax. He was responsible for everything. Majax, come over here! Yes. Yes, Mr. Bowers? Excuse me. Who is responsible for this lie? Uh, uh, no one? Ah, oh, come on. You were leaving to go to the bathroom. Don't deny it. It was you, wasn't it? All I wanted was me. But it was just a little bit of a mistake. A mistake? A mistake doesn't bring you a giant RV and four cartoon characters in my school. So, so, because of your little mistake, you are going to come back to school and apologize for bringing me this mess. Uh, are you sure? Because it's just, ah, 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 okay, 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 I'll do it. Okay, guys, I don't know how to put it right here, but this is, this is school. It's not Cartoon Network Studios. It was a mistake. You do not want to mess with a person like me. Now, go to the principal's office and don't come back ever. <sighs> Sorry, guys, for the little misunderstanding here for everything. Great. I wasted 10 minutes of my life for this. So, what brings you here again? <laughs> See, it's, it's a really funny story. <laughs> uh, apparently, uh, I accidentally put a sign that says Cartoon Network over the school sign. And uh, four cartoon characters came inside an RV. And uh, they were mad. Aw, oh, come on! Is that your best excuse? Wait. No, wait. That's supposed to be what you did wrong. All right, I'm calling. I'm calling your parents. You are gonna be very, 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 very big trouble. Mary Jack, I can't believe you put a sign over the school sign that says Cartoon Network. That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded. For three, two, three, four, four, 
days. And that's what happened. Any questions? <laughs> Oh, yeah. If you were grounded for that many days, then, uh, why are you still here? Well, uh... I am seriously starting to doubt the integrity of your story, Majax. Yeah, I don't think that story makes any sense at all. Oh, yeah? Well, uh, you have a mustache. Oh, he's right. I do. Yeah, this is stupid. Come on, Luigi. Let's go get some spaghetti. Oh, right away, Mario. Guys, guys, don't listen to Majax. He's just... He's just making this up because he's been watching too many of those stupid Go Anime videos. No, I'm not. Okay, maybe I was. And for the record, Mordecai, Finn, Gumball, and Johnny Tess do not sound like that. And I'm pretty sure I am not Majax's parent. Although if I was, yeah, I would have grounded him for that many days because he's being a complete idiot right now. I knew that story was bullshit from the very beginning because last time I checked... I never worked as a teacher. I work as a news anchor. Thank God, because if I have to deal with a bunch of stupid brats, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I think Calf perfectly describes how we all feel about this. Well, I guess you can't blame a guy for trying. <laughs> I'm gonna go. <laughs>